This is Wired Study Tips. I'm Cody Blair. The elite SEALs teams, the U.S. Navy Special Ops Forces, have discovered how to make their trainees more successful at completing the mythically tough training and actually become Navy SEALs. In fact, they now teach trainees stress control techniques that may be responsible for helping to boost the number of successful passing candidates from one-fourth of each class to one-third of each class. Amazingly, these techniques are very similar to what I've been teaching my students for years. No magic here. What I teach comes directly out of good psychological research, and the SEALs have been doing their homework. According to a recent History Channel documentary on brain science, SEAL trainees are now taught four key stress control techniques that allow them to perform better even during the grinding SEAL hell week. The four keys? Goal setting, mental rehearsal, self-talk, and arousal control. I normally teach these techniques in my GRE and SAT prep courses to help students cope with test anxiety and also in my college capable study skills seminar as a way to conquer daunting study schedules. Let's take a closer look at that first key, goal setting. If you're like me, goal setting brings to mind thick as your thigh covey planners and pretentious self-help gurus. But if the SEALs are using it, you can bet there's no namby-pamby let's all get in touch with our inner child two-day retreats going on here. Pragmatic techniques that can be used when the world is on fire are what they're looking for. Goal setting on the fly functions like this. You set your sights on an immediate, easily reachable goal and then take one step after another until you get there. Then you set a new goal. For a SEAL trainee, their internal dialogue might go something like this just gotta make it till lunch then I can rest and after lunch just gotta make it over the next hundred yards of beach and then just gotta swim this last two hundred yards the entire day is broken up into a series of individually manageable steps you can do the same during the semester to get through the mountains of work that can pile up just gotta get through this next chapter and then just gotta finish the next page of this rough draft or you can use it when test anxiety rears its ugly head just gotta finish this next problem. This technique is deceptively simple, but it's powerful and proven. It helps concentrate your efforts not on what you can't do, but what you can. How do you eat an elephant? One bite at a time. Check back soon for more mental techniques that SEALs are using to combat stress. This has been Wired Study Tips with Cody Blair. For more study techniques that can save you time and effort, come visit me at studyprof.com. Interested in an online GRE, SAT, or study skills course? Visit studentsuccess.tamu.edu.